organisms are present there, whether microorganisms are present there. There is a separate area called water analysis. So the if if let's say if we drink a glass of water, the one which, which is only it doesn't contain all those uh, heavy metals is only contain H two O. So it will really cleanse our let's say our uh, kidney. Uh, I mean it's uh, contaminated with uh, these uh, high heavy metals. So when we consume this H two O, it will cleanse the kidney uh, contaminants, isn't it? Yes. Yes, if it is so a heavy metal, drink a drink a glass of water, which is uh, purely is H two O, is we call it a reverse osmosis. Now. So it will cleanse the. Clean. I mean, let's say our kidney is a uh, kind of clean. So for for that, uh, we are having a nano filtration membrane. Okay, right. So the nano filtration membrane, if it allows, is a is a membrane. Correct. Not like uh, reverse osmosis. Uh -huh. uh, reverse osmosis. It will not allow everything uh, except water. Only it will allow water. Reverse osmosis. But in nano filtration membranes, there is they allow the minerals which are essential for our health. Ah, okay, that's uh, that's uh, the, in, in that way, the nano filtration membrane is designed okay. to keep the pore size different pore size. Okay. Reverse osmosis a very small pore size. So it will allow only the water. Yes. But in nano filtration membrane, the pore size is a little different because it will allow the water along with it will allow some mineral essential to our health. That kind of water, let's say that kind of water filter is very, I mean, very useful because it will filter minerals. Yes. We are having various uh, water technologies. We are working with them. Of uh, uh, nano filtration membrane using polymers and then uh, treatment of drinking water with the iron oxide nanoparticles and then magnetic separation of this. This iron oxide nanoparticles, if we add with the water, it will catch all the heavy metals present in the water and we can magnetically separate this iron oxide nanoparticles. There are many more technologies. Okay, let's see. Let's see our GP is a contaminated about 40%. So forty percent is already contaminated with uh, these heavy metals. Let's see if, if the water is contained with the uh, minerals. Will it cleanse the uh, the uh, I mean the heavy metals uh, contaminants in our kidney? You know, you know what I'm, uh, I'm asking this question. Is that otherwise the mineral series in our body and the kidney are more suitable for that. Otherwise the mineral series in our and the kidney are more the contaminants are suitable for that. Let's 